morning, world. I am back into business because now I have a tablet that doesn't really, well, it looks way better because we broke our tablet, as you might have noticed in the last vlog. After Trader Joe's, we just, well, not after Trader Joe's, after we went to Jason's Deli, we went for a little bit of a walk and I ended up dropping the tablet. So now it's a dead paperweight right there, the purple thing. So it took us a little while to find another tablet that was of good quality so we could take good pictures. We're starting the morning off. Madison is eating some strawberries and grapes. Yum, yum, yum. These yummy. Mmm. She loves strawberries and grapes. And they're organic too, right? Yep. I'm not really sure how this happened. Our house is now a wreck yet again. Seems like we're always doing something and I don't know, we just can't keep up with things. So I guess it's another day of cleaning the house. Of course, this is mostly from the garden. We're starting to get things from the garden and we're really excited about that. And some humongo zucchinis. A little bit of tomatoes. Our big tomatoes, um, we've had critters eating, so they haven't been sharing with us on those. Not very nice, I know. But anyway, and there's my watermelons. Ty's pulling his weight around the house right now. There's actually a fly buzzing around and he's working on catching it. Very intently concentrating. You gonna get that fly, Ty? You gonna get it? Yeah, this is your time to shine. Show them how you get that fly. Go get it. Go get it. Actually, I think it's a bee. That might not be such a good thing to um catch. <laughs> I got some of my doTERRA essential oils in. I'll show you what I got. Get some on guard and we make hand sanitizer out of this. This is the wild orange. I love to put it in my soap, my hand foaming soap. It smells really good. And this one is for Steven. It's the peppermint beadlets and we use these for breath mints. Then they're healthy breath mints. Of course, if you want any of the doTERRA oils, you can look in the link below. Everybody's working on cleaning. <laughs> Stephanie made me a smoothie because she's a great wife. Uh, you're in the shadows right now. I can't see you. But it's awesome that she made me... What, what's in this one? Fruit and goji berries. A green supplement. A green supplement? Madison, do you like it? Yeah. Yep, okay. So I guess it must be good if Madison likes it. Stephanie, do not leave me home alone with the camera or this is what you get. Dun, 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 dun. Roar. Roar. They bark. Dun dun dun. Scary dinosaur. Rawr. Dun dun dun. Well, I didn't really say anything. I just gave, the, I said, this pretty much sums it up. And I put that picture of, you know, Jesus saying, love everybody. And people are like, what if they're gay, different religions, and all this other stuff? And he goes, did I stutter? You should love everyone. <laughs> I'm recording you. You're pretty. Uh, we were talking about uh, something we did on Facebook a little bit earlier today, and Stephanie was just, and I was like, 
whoa, she commented pretty good, you know, and she was like, yeah, I'm awesome, I know it. So, yeah, she ha she, she's been telling me she's awesome her whole life. <laughs> Guys, I'm fixing to make dinner, but there's a problem. Uh, we lost the recipe. But hopefully we're going to have uh, have the recipe by the time I need it. But we've got our first things, uh, our first, uh, I guess, zucchinis in this year. They're pretty big and everything. So, and norm uh, normally, we, norm we normally make something with our zucchinis. Like, one year we made zucchini bread, which is awesome. I didn't know how good zucchini was until I actually made it. And then, and then, but Stephanie has, uh, her grandmother has a recipe for an awesome zucchini casserole. So we're going to be taking clips of me making zucchini casserole. And hopefully we'll get the recipe in time. And Stephanie's over there making herself a salad. Yes. Here's my yummy, yummy salad. Of course, I have lots of onions on top because that's just how I am right now. And my dressing is 50% organic extra virgin olive oil and 50% aged red wine vinegar curette. And this is what I love to get, just mix 50%, put on my dressing. Then it's dairy free and raw. So this is what happens when one person decides to eat a different way than the other person. I'm sitting here eating my salad as my beautiful hubby is cooking. Zucchini casserole. It's gonna be loud. Hold on, but I have to admit, I am going to eat some zucchini casserole because I absolutely love, love it. <laughs> if you want a yummy, yummy, yummy treat that is actually really healthy for you, this is what I suggest. This is a dehydrator and all these are bananas and they're dried. So they're re really sweet. And I just cut them up, put them on the dehydrator, and dry them. Good for snacks on the go, too. Then you have a healthy snack, and it's guilt-free, and so good for you, and tastes really yummy. Before Stephen puts any of the other stuff on there, look. Raw zucchini, mmm! Now, since it's all delicious and nutritious, we're going to get that back. We're going to add some cheese. Ooh, cheese. <laughs> that gets this. That gets starts making it not as nutritious anymore, but still delicious. Yeah. So we got some other stuff going to go in there. We're going to get some eggs and some other stuff. And there's some onions. Some onions. But, but it is a homemade meal, so that's going to be way better for you than. McDonald's. Yeah, or throwing something in the microwave. <laughs> and look at my little helper. Matthew, you're helping out real good. I need Daddy needs those two lids slid across the table constantly in order to make the zucchini casserole. Yes. Okay, I got the zucchini casserole in the oven right now. Got 30 minutes before it's done. Well, 29 now. Oh, and the name of this zucchini casserole is No Time Zucchini Casserole. You know why? Because it actually says four teaspoon of thyme and we are all out of thyme. So this is No Time Zucchini Casserole. <laughs> so the only way that I could get her to pick up her blocks is to drive her with Tinkerbell. And I told her if she picks all her blocks up, she can watch Tinkerbell. What do you know? She's picking up her blocks. This little girl loves Tinkerbell. And here's what it looks like completely done and cooked. Hey, okay, Madison did not really like the zucchini casserole that well, but so we were getting her some blueberries. And she's just going to town on those blueberries. She'll eat zucchini and sausage by, by themselves, but she won't eat them combined together. Home run!
She's just hitting a stick. That's how you do it. <laughs>